Hello. We're going to go over how to get Sorrow uh, in more detail. I had a previous video that showed how to get two traits, and I randomly got Sorrow, and I was like, oh, hey, you just talked to this girl to get Sorrow. That's incorrect. Uh, but here's Sorrow. It's a handgun. We're going to talk to this girl over here, this little fairy thing. It is in... It could be in the Forbidden Grove. Uh, it spawns typically... She's always in the Dappled Glade, if you get the Dappled Glade checkpoint. And supposedly, she spawns in um, the Far Woods and the Forbidden Grove. According to my spreadsheet, I've never seen her in the Far Woods. Side note, if you're doing the Red Throne storyline, you start off in Withering Weald, then you move to the Far Woods. Those are the open zones that have all the dungeons. If you're doing the Forbidden Grove, which is the Ravager storyline, then you start off in the Forbidden Grove and you move to the Faithless Thicket, which are the two zones that have all the dungeons. I've never seen them in the Red Throne storyline, so even though the wiki and other guides are saying you can get it in any Yasha storyline, in all my Yasha playthroughs, I've only ever seen it in the Forbidden Grove. So re-roll your adventure mode or story mode until Forbidden Grove starts is your starting zone instead of the Red Throne. What I've experienced and tracked on my spreadsheet. Now there's one catch to this. You need to have, and this is what I didn't know because I spam through text. I just spam the space bar to get through the conversations because I don't care. And I was rewarded sorrow. I had the tier of Keula ring. If you have it, she prompts a different dialogue and asks to have it you can trade her the tier of kayla ring for the gun now all you have to do is go back and kill um kayla's shadow the boss and uh, you'll get the ring again here's a clip of how to get the ring if you don't remember it's the ring you pick up at the end of the kayla's rest dungeon and then all of a sudden you get sucked into the water and you're engaged in the boss fight so you pick the ring up use the boss fight Here's a clip of it. I see purple. I mean, fight. Oh, because there's no checkpoint. Oh, that's nice. Got another ring. Can you please cleanse me of my sins? I'm back out front. And boss fight. But I didn't have a checkpoint. All right. Once you've got the ring, you need to be back at the Forbidden Grove, not the Far Woods. She might spawn in the Far Woods. I've never seen it. Or he, it. I don't know what it is. Um. Side note: I already have a video on it. But if you do all of the like the negative answers, the selfish answers. You get a specific trait. I want to say it's um, it's either bark skin or bloodstream. Then if you do all the positive responses, the kind ponces, whatever, you'll get the other one. So bark skin and bloodstream are the two traits you can get from her. But if you have the ring, you can also get sorrow. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and just we'll just spam through this. And do choose wisely. Do you tell your And then let me move my camera so you can see. The gun pop up. There's another little bonus. Do you keep Did you know coming up? I'll show you. Oh, that's right. She asks you the questions. What happens if you just don't? If you just mix it up. Objective scrap. Uh, tell me about this. I I I. I, I need more detail. Tell you of Ramaril. I found Ram. Nothing. None. When the d but he lifted the. He drove dust later. Holy balls! Yeah, I remember this being a story again. This must be the story that queues up if you have the ring. ring. There you go, the ring. Why do you have it? Yeah, I didn't. I found it in old temple. I killed the root monster and took it. It is my. You killed her. Uh, she on behalf. Of all of my Give tier of Kayla. See, I didn't pay. I just click on stuff. <laughs> it even says it. That's funny. All right. Boom. Sorrow. Level two. So if you already have a weapon 
and there's stuff in the game that give you the direct weapons, not the crafting materials, it'll just upgrade it one level every time. So whenever you run by areas that you've already completed to get a secret weapon, do it again. It'll save on resources. And if you do it enough times and you're playing enough times and you get it to level 10, that's a free... You don't... Well... I haven't gotten any to level 10 yet, so I don't know if it'll actually automatically upgrade to level 10. But if it does, it'll save you a simulcrum, a simsim. But I have a feeling it stops at 9. Maybe not. Maybe not. Anyways, that is how you get sorrow. And then the two traits really quick. Let me just uh, show you just because. So if you want to get both traits, you'll have to run this twice. Or run two rerolls to have two interactions with her. The bloodstream is the gray health regen trait, and then bark skin is your damage reduction trait. And those are obtained from her as well. Again, Forbidden Grove, not the Red Throne storyline, even though supposedly she spawns in that one. I've never seen it, and I've ran Yesha more than anything. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Anyways, on that note, see you in the next one. Bye now.